Oh, it's been a while. Subway's got to be clear of the city by now. Along with your hot date? Nah, but she's not like that. Hell, she's not like anybody. <clears throat> Find Dr. Bear. Now we got, oh, we're getting the assault rifle, AR, handgun ammo, combat knife. Okay, okay. The basics. The basics. Hmm. Hmm. Costumes. Ooh. Ooh, goddamn. Ooh, goddamn. I go with the classic. What about Carlos? Oh, thank the Lord, bro. I ain't. Why? Why did they do that? Wrong on classic hair for Carlos. Oh, Carlos looks sexy with that hair. Why? Why would they? Why? What the fuck? What? What the? Why? Why would they even not? What do you mean? The new hair is way better. He looks like a fucking rat's nest. You're out of your minds. <laughs> Default's better. You guys are fucking trolls. Looks like a cemetery to me. Oh my god, dude, he's daddy as fuck now. Look at that shit. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Dude, they this game is really fucking beautiful. I wish that I had played the original Resident Evil Three from '98 or whenever it did come out. I think it was 98. Granted, I was seven years old. Not really the type of game that I should have been playing at seven. At least my, I didn't even own a PlayStation. All right. I was a Nintendo kid. I was playing a lot of Diddy Kong racing. Uh, are you saying some final words or something? Come on, let's fucking get, let's go. Can't believe you guys like this hair on Carlos. Brad, stop. T. Come on, man. Oh, now Brad. Wait, what? No, he bit his dick! Oh. I thought my man's got his dick chewed off. That's like the worst way to go. Shit, it's locked. You stay on the door. I got this fucker. I gotta kill Brad? No, I don't wanna kill Brad. Uh, I'm gonna use my pistol. I don't wanna waste ammo. Oh my God. The reticle. Ah! I don't have any upgraded weapons. Fuck you! Wait, what is his? Is his melee a? Uh, is that a dodge or is? Oh, it's like a. Oh shit! Well, that's not. I'm sorry, Brad, but I have to kill you. Brad. Brad. No! Can I not kill this motherfucker? All right, let me in. Where'd that cop go? Don't know, don't care. We got a job to do. Our intel's still worth a Holy damn. Holy shit! In the star's office. Let's find him and take him into custody. Oh no! This custody. I forgot about this area. This was a rescue. Carlos, take a look at this. This whole the, the whole police station office. Resident Evil Two was Remember, a bitch. Bard had access to Umbrella's darkest secrets. He knows we'll try to keep him under our thumbs. So this search and rescue mission is really more like find and detain. Hmm. Right. Good to know. I'll open the shutter so you can get through. You stay here and find out what's been going on here at the station. Call you if I find anything. Hey. Be careful. Hey. Yeah. Be careful. Me too, man. All right. All right. Well, I'm fuck. I'm fine, I guess. Even though Brad just tried to fucking diddle me. He tried to give it to me, didn't he? Is that? Look at how. That's a little baby microphone. Look at how tiny that thing is. Why, why is that microphone so small? <laughs> wait, wait. How are they gonna have a remote, like a TV remote, that was fucking massive, and then this little tiny microphone? It's like as big as a pen. This game's wild, bro. The 90s, dude. The 90s were crazy. 
Dude, the hair is so bad. Look at this. Look at this. How are you going to tell me that this hair is better than the classic Carlos hair? Look at Carlos. He's a fucking... Oh, my goodness. I'm soaked. I'm soaked to the brim looking at this man right now. Why? Because that's just the classic Resident Evil hair. It's not good enough? No. Let's put a fucking rat's nest on his head. Oh, yeah. Cool. Wait. Is that ammo right there? That's like a box of candy. All right. All right. So he wants us to go that way. Let me do a little exploring first. That's the now library. The fucking door. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I want to hear him say that. Now here's a weird fucking door. <laughs> oh, I like Carlos already, man. Carlos is the man. Area Whoa. Looks clear. Area looks clear. In Resident Evil fucking 2, it wasn't. What's going on with the ground? Looks like it has hair. Got Carlos hair. Thank you. All right, we got to get some upgrades for Carlos's weapons because this shit is inaccurate. I was I'm so used to to Jill's red dot now. Thing was that thing was money. I hate that this is the fast. This is sprinting in Resident Evil. I love Resident Evil, but good god, this is so fucking slow. That's the library, right? I just or or the records room. This is a fucking police station. I don't think police stations have libraries. What do I know? I don't know. I'm not a cop. All right. I assume. It, well, I I don't. I'm not gonna assume anything. I don't know. I don't know what the fuck's gonna happen. I just like that we're in we're in the same area. What is this? Wait, what? What the fuck is this? I'm gonna need a star's ID to crack this open. Oh, ID card will be required to uh, access all storage boxes. Okay. Sounds good. What is that? What the hell was that? Thing? I don't know, but let's not fucking go towards it. Isn't there a safe room over here? Brad? Wait, that's that's hanging up in Resident Evil 2. That's how it got there? Bro, this is so fucking dope. Uh, here we go. Ah. I need meds. I need meds. Good fucking God. Flash grenade. Okay. Oh, I have. Uh, I don't know if I want to use that yet. Might be able to find something I can combine it with. Sorry. I said I have a ammo. You copy? There's CAP locker room. In here. I don't know what it is. Something nasty. <laughs> Why does he say nasty like that? Something nasty. Ooh, nope. I'm good. I'm gonna use this. At least that won't be one hit. I know he's gonna open... Jesus. Okay, wait. That's unlocked. Yeah, come this way. Come on. Oh, wait. Let's test out this flash grenade. 
Are you all dazed? Okay, that was a waste. Jesus Christ. How many are there? Okay, ammo is not, this is not gonna be the way. Go through the fucking door, Carlos. Go back this way. We can't go back this way. Fuck me, dude. All right, we got to clear them out. Hey, Chunk. Hey, Chunk! Chill! No! Jesus, man. Hardcore does not fuck around in this game. Oh, I got so much ammo? I didn't realize I had like 200 rounds. I need meds so badly. Shouldn't have wasted that. Watch, I'm gonna get a red out of this or something. Oh, even better. Thank you. I need a key card. Where the fuck? These things don't fucking die. I don't. I wish I remembered. If I could remember the combination from the last game, I can't. <gasps> ah! You're still not fucking dead! Jesus Christ, sir! How many bullets do you fucking take, brother? Oh, now you're dead, huh? But I'm burning through this ammo fast. Like, fast. There's more... See, this is from Resident Evil 2, this desk. You're supposed to unlock that. Of course, of course I find the red shit now. David Ford, you get into his desk. I don't remember the I don't remember the combination. I don't remember where to find the combination. Another one? Sir. You don't need to come into work today! Dude, I'm gonna die. I am royally getting my ass beat. Safe room's under here, right? I do remember this. At least it was a safe room in Resident Evil 2. He resists a number three number combination safe. Move from Star's office, second floor, to West Office, first floor. 9157. If cameras killed those things, I'd be set. <laughs> oh, I love that. That's fucking. F <laughs> oh, dude, this is so good after playing Resident Evil 2. <laughs> okay, 9:15:7. Bitch! How many? And in hardcore, I cannot use my fucking knife, like, at all. Was it 9-14-7? Oh, 
What was it? Now I don't remember. Nine nine fifteen seven. No, what was it? Is that the wrong way? Shit. There we go. Ooh, more upgrade. Thank you. More space. All right, we gotta find a key card. Can't go in there yet, so I guess we're going this way. Kind of fucked up shooting cops. Yeah, super fucked up, Carlos. What the fuck's wrong with you? Okay, we can't go this way. Oh, uh, we gotta go upstairs. I hear some banging. Uh, I'm gonna go save actually. If I save now, please save. Oh, I got some tunes in here. God, it's fucking dark. Carlos, the star's office is up ahead. Copy that. Is that a fucking scooter? What is this? Oh. It's a vacuum. That makes so much more sense. <laughs> Note to a friend. Hector, if you're reading this, I'm already dead. If you hear any noises coming from the locker, do not open it, please. We don't have any batteries for the detonator, but I'm pretty sure I sent one to the safety deposit room. Can't get in. We need that battery if we're going to knock this wall down. So I headed upstairs to find you since I know you have the safety deposit room key. Upstairs. Safe. Okay. Break the shower room wall. No, fuck. Wait, wait. Cap. Is it cap? It is. Flash grenade, bitch. Better not. What do you mean better not? Because they need that in Resident Evil 2? The crossover is incredible. Okay. This is how the wall, this is how, there's a, this is why there's a hole in the wall in Resident Evil 2. Okay. Guess we'll be doing this the explodey way. Explodey. That was a floor polisher? That's what you think. Wait, how do I use this thing? Use. Turn it on. Oh, I need the battery. And I gotta go upstairs. Duh. Okay, okay. I gotta go, okay. Do I wanna, I'm just gonna put that, leave that there so it's not in my inventory though. I don't need to hold it. Was I holding on to that thing the whole time? Oh, sake. Why is it blocked? It's always blocked. Everything's blocked in this game. Don't, don't, come on. Don't do it, bro. Is this the safety? Is that the safety deposit box key? Thought I was gonna have to find it on somebody. Oh, which one? Is, what is this? Why do I think this one's ABC? It's not. But why do I think that? It can't be ABC. I'm a fucking idiot. What? What? Ah, there it is. <laughs> <laughs> Not the right answer, unfortunately. <gasps> ah! Fuck you! Slice your fucking knees, bro. No, no, no. I need to go back down. Oops. Don't come down here, sir. I'm trying to. I'm trying to polish the floor. Try to get all this fucking blood off the goddamn floor. All you and your nasty ass co-workers are blading all over it. Ah! What the fuck? Nope. There you are, dick face. You know that guy? Ah! 
Oh, I fucking countered him. I don't know how I did that. I don't know what is going on. Shoot that fucker in his brain. I'm dead. Dude, he bitch slapped me to death. He legitimately bitch slapped me. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> I swear there was a, a door here in Resident Evil 2. Okay, fuck. Sir? Stop resisting. Stop resisting. Stop! <sighs> How the fuck am I gonna defeat this guy? How am I gonna defeat this fucking guy? I don't know. I don't know what to do. Oh my god, my man is fucking nasty! I am slower than he is by like, by a lot. I don't... So I don't know how I'm supposed to fucking kill him. He doesn't go upstairs, huh? That brain's exposed, but obviously you're a fucking idiot! Where'd you go? He don't go upstairs, I guess. He said, nah. You're gonna, you're gonna pop out again? Where'd he go? Oh, I beat him. DCM Roger <gasps> Sir Not cool bro Not fucking cool You need to be dead Don't come back There you go Now I think you're dead Okay anything that's pre-opened uh what do we need to open can we open oh 104 that's the battery i need oh the numbers are missing what was the other one i need open uh 104 106 109 Man, look at the pixels. <laughs> Thank God we don't need anything on the other side. That's for, you know, some dumbass. Mine now. Mine now. Can't wait to suck on this nine volt. Come the papa. <laughs> oh, fuck. Weapons locker? There's nothing even in the weapons locker. Wait, what? Why is there nothing in the weapons locker? Oh, little snake. Okay. Ah, no, no. What am I doing? Dude, I'm not faster than this fucking, I cannot outrun it. What?
Did I kill that thing? Oh, I finally killed it. Okay. Jesus. Let's just use this. All right. Uh, now we got to go back up here. Right? I think, yeah. Go over here to the bathroom. We got the battery for the the, uh, the bomb, the detonator. Carlos, I've hit a dead end with the terminal here. Got to head your way. Copy that. Oh, wait. Well, hang on. We saving, bro. We saving. I'm out. I'm out of my mind if I'm not saving right here. We got to be smart about this. Bro. Come on. No. Yeah, I was, we're done with you. You're you're dead. You got to be dead. Just like your fucking co-workers and your entire family and everyone you've ever known and anyone you've ever seen. They're all fucking dead. All right. So don't fucking come back. There's no one in this in this world that loves you anymore. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. True, 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 true. Gotta go all the way up, open that locker. It's a DCM takedown. Duh. Oh, here. <laughs> People just fucking livid. It. It's DMC takedown. Actually, it's DMCA takedown. Sorry. All right. Now we go this way. And we put the stuff in the stuff. Battery. Combine this. The detonator has power. And we insert the detonator. And then we step the fuck away. Three s Get further away! What the fuck? What a psycho! And that is how- Ah! Okay! And that's how the steam got there. It's just, it all makes sense. Because we were taking a hot shower. Ah! Who the fuck are you?! Oh my god. Come on! What did he No! I'm gonna die. Alrighty. Fuck that guy, dude. Fuck that guy. Uh, so, how the fuck do I use his ability? They're drowning me in the shower! What is going on right now? Oh, well, good thing I saved. If you're a good shot, the game says, fuck you. <laughs> Take offense to that. Now I gotta go get my locker open again. Man. Resident Evil 3, or uh, Resident Evil games just like, they hit different, right? Like what a, what a phenomenal IP. Uh, what was it again? DMC. No, D DCM. DCM. Oh. Okay. Lego. We get into this sheet. For sure. Yeah, I got nades to clear these boys out. I didn't I just didn't think there was going to be so many. Firm. All right. Gotta move. Maybe I'll use a frag actually. Clear these boys out. Hello. Oh shit. Shit. fucking melee him. Oh, bitch! Suck on it! Oh, no. 
Oh no. Oh, motherfucker. Come on, dude. When they're flashed, you can just go up and fucking pl No, not another one of these fuckers. I'm dead. Oh, get fucked. No, bitch, get off me. Are you fucking kidding me, sir? This section is absolutely fisting me. Like I was saying earlier, I am my favorite Resident Evil game of all time is Resident Evil 4. Uh, that game I beat it about four or five times. It's absolutely incredible. It, uh, oh my god, that game doesn't get much better than that. All right, uh, this time I'm gonna do this, and I'm gonna go save again. Oops. Maybe you should turn it to beginner. Hell no. It's okay to die sometimes in a game, bro. You know? Don't have to be the goat. Sometimes I like a good challenge. And I don't remember Resident Evil 2 being very hard. And I don't think I played it on a hardcore difficulty. So I'm fine with playing on this, this one on a hardcore. And shoot, I'm already, it's not that long of a game and I'm what, three hours? I'm like halfway through it already, I think. And it's, it hasn't been too tough. What are you buying? What are you selling? Oops. All right, uh, put the detonator on, let's go. All right. Attempt number three. Move. So what I'm thinking is this is what we're gonna do. Flash out. One at a time, take a number. Start beating their asses. Uh, he's not stunned, I guess. We're gonna take this. Oh. There we go. Let's boogie. I'll be able to loot this this time. Wait, somebody's not dead? Bitch! Sucks to be popular. His one-liners are great. Yeah, Resident Evil was one of those series that um, I just never played really as a kid until Resident Evil 4 because I was too young. And my parents... They let me play mo shit. Oh, I forgot that this guy spawns here. Fuck. Okay, I gotta. I gotta remember that he doesn't dodge, he counterattacks or some shit. Is he dead? Oh my god. Jesus fucking Christ. Dr. Bard. Oh, thank God. Did you know how long I've been trying to reach somebody? Okay, well, I'm here. We're gonna get you out of there. Just tell me where you are. I'm trapped in a goddamn hospital, surrounded by every kind of abomination. Look, just send in stars. They're gonna know what to do. No, negative. RPD's overrun, too. Then figure it out! Umbrella's gone crazy. They're killing all the researchers. I am the only one who knows how to make the vaccine to stop the zombies. So you can either sit there with your dick in your hand or send, send somebody who's capable of getting me the hell out of here. What a fucking prick. I like him already. Damn, that dude's jacked. 
He's got a small little head, but he kind of jacked. Said, we can't turn him over to the company. That's not our call to make. That's Mihail's call. I'm going to check the computer, see if I can trace the doc's location. Oh, you're a hacker? Yeah, backtrace that IP address, bro. Find that shit. This will take some time. Look around. See oh, great. Oh, meds. Thank the Lord. Please tell me there's a typewriter in here. I can save my shit. There's got to be. There's got to be. This seems like a typewriter type of place, you know? Report on the mansion in incident. This bizarre incident occurred in a mansion owned by the Umbrella Corporation located in the Arclay Mountains. On July 23rd, Stars Bravo team was dispatched to the Arclay Mountains to investigate a series of mysterious and grisly murders and went unexpectedly radio silent. On July 24th, Alpha team was dispatched as well and became entangled in the events at the nearby mansion. Oh, we all know what happened. That's, uh... Alice. Is that Jill in the front row? What the fuck? How are you, how are you supposed to see that? I thought this was supposed to be remastered. That's that Resident Evil 1 shit. There's really no top, top, top rata? Dude, what the fuck? Where do I find this goddamn key card? Is there really no typewriter in here? Oh shit, I thought there would be. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna go this way. Yeah, what's up? Derailed. Was anyone hurt? Jill? Oh, he's just now finding out. Ah, oh, shit. Wait, what? Jill! Jill, what happened? He's a traitor! Jill, come in! T, I gotta go. Do what you gotta. I'll take care of Bart. 4.43 a.m. September 29th. The Carlos Express. Several minutes earlier. Subway tunnels. Ooh. Oh, it's her new outfit, bro. She crashed and now she got a new outfit. Little, little quick costume change. Fine. Yeah, she is. Ooh, dude, this outfit's way better. Am I the only one who made it? Oh, uh, shit. Okay. Wait, did I miss anything back here? What's that on the ground? Just garbage? Just trash? Okay. So what happens if that's just too strong and she can't get through it? Too rusted. She just stuck forever down there to die. Carlos, come in. Video games are Carlos? weird. Carlos, Carlos, sweet baby Carlos. Mine rounds. Ooh. Uh. I don't know. Uh. Shit. Oh, I have a crate here. What is this? Good news, limp dicks. I've got some new weaponry for you that's guaranteed to put the brass back in your sacks. They're called mine rounds. These babies were developed by Umbrella's military R&D, and they will light your fires even hotter than the lover you left back home. They're tough to find and tricky to handle, but trust me, they're worth it. All right, let's take a look at the specs. Mine rounds are designed for standard issue grenade launchers. Don't get cute and try to load them in anything else. Fire them at the walls or the ground, and they'll stay right where you put them. The sensor in the mine will detect approaching enemies and detonate when they get them within range. Okay. Simple enough. Limp dicks. Um, what can I put away? I don't know. I guess storing this gunpowder. Take these. Ooh. You actually see it? What the fuck? It's kind of weird. All right. Cannot believe you guys fucking like Carlos's mop. 